Well, the way that this is translated in NIV, starting in verse 26, says, Therefore I do not run like someone running aimlessly. I do not fight like a boxer beating the air. No, I strike a blow to my body and make it my slave. So I strike a blow to my, like, like, I mean, the way that reads is, you're literally gonna, gonna, I mean, it wasn't me to strike a blow. No! <laughs> And it's kind of funny, it's kind of silly, but you know there are people in the world that believe that they're extra spiritual when they put themselves through pain and torture. There's Catholics in, I think it's either in the Philippines or some of one of the Asian countries that they go through these, these rituals every year to kind of reproduce like the pain and suffering that Jesus went through. And they'll like go through, the, they'll whip themselves and flog themselves and do these things and think that they're being, you know, extra spiritual by doing these things. And when you read a translation like this, they could toy that and say like, no, I strike a blow to my body and make it my slave. See, it's in the Bible. Whereas we say, no, God doesn't want you destroying your body, the temple of the Holy Ghost, and just, you know, doing these things for no reason. If you end up suffering persecution at the hands of someone else, that's different than you just taking it on yourself to strike a blow to your own body. Because that's not what this verse says, and it's not what it teaches at all. It's just talking about being in control and not allowing your body to come to harm or get yourself into sin. So, anyways, I, I just threw that in there because... The first time I heard that, <laughs> I kind of, I laughed like pretty much everybody here did because it is kind of funny, but there are people who actually believe this, that that is God's word and it couldn't be farther from the truth. And we need to just be able to expose this type of stuff so that people who are deceived into thinking that, hey, I'm reading God's word to show them stuff like this. Like this is ridiculous. This is not what God's saying at all. How could you pick up that book and read that garbage and say, yep, these are God's words? It's not true. It's false.